Hey everybody, I'm Ward Stills, and today I am going to be showing you how to make a working lighthouse in Minecraft. Alright, first of all, I just want to mention that the original idea was from Penguins Have Power, so guys go check out his channel, he's got, he's got some great uh, redstone slash piston ideas and inventions. They're really cool, so go check them out. Great ideas. Alright, so first of all, I'll show you how the lighthouse works. So actually what you're going to need is, t uh, to make it, you're going to need redstone repeaters, uh, sticky pistons, redstone, regular track, uh, red, uh, what's called redstone torches, fast minecart track, detector rail, minecart, and sandstone or a block of your choice and glowstone. Okay, <clears throat> so first of all, what we're gonna do is I've wired the bottom track. I mean, I've wired the track here in the bottom with redstone. So you're gonna switch that on first. I'll show you underneath here in a second how all the redstone works. So now that the rails are turned on, we're going to place our... Hold on, let me try to fly. Alright, we're going to place our minecart on the track here. Push it. And it's going to revolve around here. And as it comes around here, I'll show you. See, when it hits those detector rails, there's pistons in there that pull sandstone down and reveal glowstone. Like a continuous revolving lighthouse. See, it's pretty cool. Basic idea. And it's pretty simple, too. So I'll show you how this works. Hold on, let me turn this off. Alright, so, how this works is you're going to take your fast track, put it all the way around here with detector rail attached to, oops, I'm turning rain off. Alright, attached to these repeaters here, which will then trigger these redstone torches, which will trigger these sticky pistons. And when the minecart goes over the detector rail, it'll trigger all this, uh, which will make the pistons pull down the sandstone and then reveal the glowstone underneath. Here, I'll show you. I'll go in there. Alright. See, it pulls it down and then the glowstone's behind it. It's a little square. Like this. So, when that sandstone goes down, glowstone is revealed. So, it's a pretty simple lighthouse. I mean, you could, you could probably do it however you want, make it a different way or something. It's just a simple version. Alright, so, under here is the redstone wiring. I did this just in a sort of easy way. I didn't completely, like, cover it. I mean, it looks a little abnormal with all this sandstone sticking out, but... <clears throat> first of all, your redstone attaches to a lever up there so you can turn it on and off. You don't really need to have it off. I mean, if you always want your lighthouse going, just keep it on. So, you're going to want repeaters just attached to your fast track and then attached to redstone. So, but you don't want to attach the detector rail because that'll uh, trigger off when your minecart hits it. So make sure there's no redstone or repeaters touching your detector rail. You just want repeaters and redstone touching your fast rail. That's it. Nothing else. See in here? Nothing is touching the detector rail. Just fast track. Alright. So that's basically a simple tutorial on how to make your Minecraft continuous lighthouse. Alright guys, there you have it. Thanks again to Penguins Have Power for the original idea. Go check out his channel, guys. That's Penguins Have Power. Alright, thanks for watching, guys. Stay classy, YouTube.